Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl in your face while you're sleeping. The 10 Most Dangerous Dinosaurs in the World Dinosaurs are some of the most vicious ancient creatures on the planet. Can you imagine seeing the sight of giant reptiles roaming the land with claws the sizes of small trees? Or picture coming across a lizard with teeth the size of a Coke bottle? The first genus appeared during the late Triassic period, around 243 to 247 million years ago. Triassic jurassic extinction events made dinosaurs dominant terrestrial vertebrates throughout the Jurassic and Cretaceous periods. Since their extinction about 66 million years ago, dinosaurs have been a subject of great interest for researchers, historians, and academics. And with that being said, let's take a look at 10 of the most dangerous dinosaurs that ever existed, and just how you would fare in a world where these vicious creatures still existed. You won't believe which dinosaur was considered more aggressive and vicious than the T-Rex, despite them looking very much the same. Number 10. Velociraptors There's no doubt that velociraptors are considered some of the most dangerous dinosaurs in ancient history. And it's not that their size was intimidating or anything, but the sheer use of their brawn is what made them formidable predators. Armed with uncanny speed and a pair of razor-sharp toe claws, they could tear their prey from limb to limb. What made them such successful predators is that they relied on the smart flanking techniques to overwhelm and overpower prey. They continue to remain one of the most iconic carnivorous dinosaurs of all time, despite being undersized compared to the legendary T-Rex or Spinosaurus. Number 9. The Stygi Moloch I may have said that wrong, but while the Stygi Moloch wasn't the most aggressive dinosaur in the world, it was a terrifying sight, especially if you were hypothetically time warped back to the Jurassic and came across this monster. When agitated, this giant beast was capable of going head-to-head -head with the biggest and baddest dinosaurs around. It had a hard cranium that could crush steel, and it used its evolutionary advantage to ramp up its predators. At full speed, a couple of rams from this dinosaur was lights out, even for a T-Rex. They are closely related to a Pachyosaur, a dinosaur that was about the same size, with the only difference that it had bumps instead of horns protruding from its tough cranium plate. Number 8. Allosaurus one of the most infamous dinosaurs in the history books, the Allosaurus is usually confused with the T-Rex because of how similar they are in size and shape. However, to a dinosaur expert and paleontologist, these two dinosaurs are extremely different. For example, Allosaurus was without a doubt a scavenger. However, according to recent evidence from archaeological discoveries, the creature could also have tussled with dangerous prey like the Stagosaurus leading to fatal wounds. They were also highly aggressive, and truth be told, you were better off facing a T-Rex than coming into the path of a juvenile Allosaurus. Number 7. Dilophosaurus Extra large lizards with extra large teeth. Could nature be any crueler? I guess so, considering that this dinosaur was the stuff of nightmares. We're pretty sure a number of herbivores had sleepless nights knowing that this creature could be lurking behind a tree or a bush. In terms of size, the Dilophosaurus was not that impressive. It was slightly larger than a dog, but what it lacked in size it made up for in sheer evolutionary abilities. And if you want a sneak peek at just how dangerous and aggressive this creature was, simply take a look at the scene in Jurassic Park when Dennis came across this ghastly beast. At first, the creature seemed a little cautious about him, but it was unsure whether he was predator or prey. But as soon as it identified him as a potential meal, it flared its hood and spit venom into his eyes. Paralyzed, the creature proceeds to viciously devour Dennis like the hopeless victim that he is. Number 6. Baryonyx Despite being one of the lesser-known predators in the history books, the Baryonyx was no doubt as powerful and as aggressive as some of the biggest carnivorous dinosaurs on the planet. While it might be smaller than predators like the T-Rex, it was highly agile and could be able to slip through cramped crevices and spaces just to search for prey. Baryonyx had a mouth shaped like that of a crocodile, and it possessed large claws that were about 31 centimeters long, and even had a few modifications on its sized thumb. To hunt for prey, archaeologists believe that Baryonyx might have had to crouch on riverbanks and wade in shallow waters to hunt for fish. In the times that food was scarce, the Baryonyx turned into a scavenger. Number 5. Pteranodon Remember reading those creepy stories of creatures coming from the sky and grabbing unsuspecting children and young adults before flying them away to their inevitable demise? If not, then you probably didn't spend a lot of time in the library. Okay, we're kidding. On another front, the Pteranodon was a terrifying winged predator of massive size that was large enough to pluck human beings from the ground like featherweights and carry them off to be devoured. 
Thankfully, the Pteranodon lived millions of years before our time. But could you imagine how many unfortunate children would have been the victim of these creatures? This is one of the situations where we say, thank God the dinosaurs went extinct. Number 4. Carnotaurus. The Carnotaurus was one of the strangest and most dangerous meat-eating dinosaurs in the world. It had a short skull, was surrounded by spiked armor, and according to some archaeologists, had lizard-like scales all over its body. On top of its head, it had a large pair of sharp horns. Despite its massive size, this dinosaur had unusually small eyes for its head. Because of its incredibly short arms, Carnotaurus was usually confused with the T-Rex, but it had a much weaker bite force, so it's possible that it did not attack big plant eaters. Because of its long and powerfully built legs, this creature most likely fed on smaller prey and also scavenged in times of scarcity. And even though the ancient creature is widely regarded as an optimistic predator, the Carnotaurus may have evolved extremely poor hearing, which would have been a downside in nature. Number 3. Triceratops if you'd like to have an idea of how a Triceratops would have behaved in modern times, just have a look at the rhino. Despite being a plant eater, this ancient dinosaur was just as aggressive and territorial. In fact, some archaeologists believe that you had a better chance of surviving a T-Rex attack than coming across a herd of Triceratops. These were massive beasts that possessed a hard head comprising of several horns that could impale its predators and rivals alike. Though presumed to be relatively benign, the Triceratops can become fiercely aggressive if provoked. Its danger quotient lies in a combination of its immense size and weight, plus a hard head carapace consisting of multiple horns that can impale both its rivals and predators. On a lighter note, the Triceratops is one of the most famous dinosaurs in Hollywood. It's had its fair share of screen time in a number of films including Jurassic Park. So now we've come to the best pick of the day, a Spinosaurus versus a T-Rex battle. Which animal do you think would win? While both are formidable foes, this picture tells only half of the story. You see, a T-Rex is far more aggressive and hunts much larger creatures as compared to the Spinosaurus. On the other hand, the Spinosaurus is significantly larger than the T-Rex, so there's no way that the T-Rex would be able to take down the Spinosaurus this easily. In reality, the Spinosaurus would most likely dominate the T-Rex and take him out effortlessly. Thankfully, both creatures lived in different times from each other, so this fight never would have happened in history. But wouldn't it be fun to make this recreation today? I don't know about you, but my money would be on Spino right here, because in the absence of brains, Braun will take the win all the time. Number 2. Dimorphodon As one of the first in the line of primitive flying reptiles, the Dimorphodon lived during the early Jurassic period, about 180 million years ago. It was about three and a half feet long and had large eyes. With well-developed limbs, it most likely walked with two legs. Despite its small size, it was a voracious predator that fed on much smaller creatures. It also had wings that were made up of thin membranes of skin that stretched from the enormously elongated fourth finger of each hand and went back to the hip or hind limbs. To fly successfully, the Dimorphodon had an exceedingly long tail for its body size that enabled it to maintain stable during flight. It also possessed a large breastbone and also had a large crest on the humerus upon which a series of powerful flight muscles were attached. While it might not have had the capacity to take down a fully grown human being, small kids would have been easy prey for this ancient flying reptile. Number 1. Mosasaurus If the Mosasaurus wasn't an aquatic predator, it's safe to say that it would have dominated the land without question. Yes, the ancient waters were a death trap for any animal that unfortunately found itself lost at sea. This is, without a doubt, one of the most fearsome and dangerous dinosaurs that ever lived. It would make the Megalodon look like a clown with sheer size and ferocity. The sheer size of the Mosasaurus is incredible, and its killer jaws can make mincemeat out of even larger prey. What's truly terrifying is the realization that it doesn't actually need to chew, but simply swallows its prey whole. If one of these evolved limbs and made it onto land, its doubtful humans would be around to tell the tale. And with that being said, we've come to the end of this video. So, which one of these dinosaurs scared you the most? And which one of these dinosaurs would you not dare dream of facing in an alleyway? Let us know in the comment section down below. Want more videos that will exist until the end of time? Click on any of the videos that you see on the screen. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and click on that notification bell to get more mind-blowing content.